Hi guys and welcome to my channel! In this video I am going to do a lip swatch video and swatch video in general. I have bought the new holiday collection from Jeffree Star. I bought five of them. I don't know why I didn't buy the sixth one. But I think it was because it was a new shade and it was very similar to this one. I think. Now I regret it though. But actually when I opened this package I had forgotten how many lipsticks I had bought because it was Black Friday so they were only two dollars off which is not that much actually but in my head I felt that it was a good idea to just buy them all pretty much so I also have a lot of the like regular velour liquid lipsticks uh, so if you want me to do a another uh, your free star lip swatch video just tell me in the comments but besides the holiday collection i will also be swatching the new skin frosts i have the shade deep freeze which is a uh, like turquoise blue and then regina george which is a hot pink and then i also bought the ice cold because i've never tried his skin frosts and i think i will love this one uh, so I will be swatching these ones as well. So if you want to see all of these swatches, just keep on watching. I will start off by swatching the lightest shade in the collection, which is called Chrysanthemum. I'm totally not saying that right, but yeah, let's do it. So this is how it looks when it has dried completely. I really hope you can see it, but it actually has some like gold reflexes in it. And it looks gorgeous. They feel just like the other Velour Liquid lipsticks in my opinion. And they smell also, I think it is that root beer smell like the other ones are. Like most of them are. I think it, yeah. I don't really know, I've never tasted root beer. <laughs> but yeah, that is chrysanthemum, if I'm saying that right. <laughs> Next up, I will swatch this shade called Pumpkin Pie. And this is also one of the uh, uh, lipsticks with gold reflexes in it. I really hope you guys can see it. It's gorgeous and I love orange lipsticks. So I think this will be a favorite of mine. And this one has the same smell. I absolutely love orange lipsticks, so I love this one. <laughs> it is so nice, but as I said, it also has these gold reflexes in it. I'm not really sure. It looks like it's gold in the tube, but it looks more like red reflexes. Am I saying reflexes? Red glitters on the lips. And it looks lovely, let me just tell you. I just love these kinds of shades with my skin tone. I think it looks so cute. So this was Pumpkin Pie. And next up is the shade Deceased that I am so excited to wear. These have no glitters in it. It's just a completely matte shade. It's this very like I'm dead color. <laughs> Uh, so we'll see if it suits me, but I actually love to wear like cool tone nudes. I think they suit me very nice. So yeah, let's try it on. So this shade is for sure a very purple shade, but I still would say it's a nude. I thought it would make me feel more like washed out than it has. I really like that. <laughs> so yeah, this is the shade Deceased. And now for some color again. This one is the shade Designer Blood. It is very similar to Unicorn Blood that I also bought and got today. I'm so excited about it. I don't remember the difference between them, but I think that this should have also gold reflexes in it, but I can't see it. So we'll try it on and see what happens. <laughs> 
Yes! <laughs> I love it! Okay, I am so sorry about the awful application of this. When it's on, I can see the difference. And the difference between this one and Unicorn Blood is that it dries like a... It's like an overlay of gold, if that makes any sense. Like, it's this goldish dark red. You can't see any like glitters or anything like that, but it just dries to like this bronze blood red <laughs> yeah it's just like the perfect dark red but with a twist so it just makes it a little bit extra which I love <laughs> so yeah this one is unicorn no it's not <laughs> so, <laughs> so yeah this one is designer blood but it was a struggle to get off I have a lot of like concealer now on my lips just because they were stained but now is the last lip swatch and this one is the one that you guys are most excited about, I'm sure. And I'm too. <laughs> it is Crocodile Tears. How cool is this? Like what have I been without this in my life? I don't know. I love it so much and the packaging, I haven't even talked about the packaging yet. It's so cool. And this one with the red and the green, I love. So Christmassy and so cool and I love it. So, let's put it on. Like how cool is this color? I am going to rock this so much <laughs> this year and the next year obviously. It just screams me for some reason and I think of Graveyard Girl also. She will probably love this one. All of them has had pretty much the same formula, texture, same smell. Once again this is Crocodile Tears. And now let's swatch the highlighters. First off, how big are these. I have heard from everyone pretty much on YouTube that they say that they are huge but when I got them I was shook. <laughs> I thought that I could swatch them on my hand first and then I can swatch them on my face so you can see. I will start off by swatching Deep Freeze. It's this one. Gorgeous. Oh my god that's a blue shade <laughs> i am not really sure how i will make these work as highlighters but i just know that i will <laughs> uh, next one that i'm going to swatch is regina george and this one i think would be really gorgeous as a blush as well and uh, that is regina george so cool. I did notice that if you used to take a tiny tiny bit of them, they are very light. Uh, so you can really build them up and here they are very built up. I just wanted to see how intense they could be. But yeah, Regina George as a blush. Fuck yeah. So next one I am going to swatch Ice Cold and this one is like everybody's favorite and I think I will love it. It's just this ice cold highlighter <laughs> and I am very pale so I think it will suit me perfectly. Here they are. I did think that it would be more of a cool toned, uh, the ice cold one. It's a white with gold reflexes in I think. I thought it would be more cool toned but it's not. I think we could start off by using ice cold actually. Just like a normal highlight and we will see how good it is. I do have highlighter on, but it is nothing strong at all. But now, let's try the shade Ice Cold. Okay, ready for it? Oh, that is blinding. <laughs> Insane. I would use some on my nose as well. <laughs> okay, I 
love this one so much this will be my new favorite for sure next off i will use regina george but i think i will use regina george as blush is that okay i think it is so i will just use this underneath the ice cold I don't know what you guys think, but I love this. <laughs> I think I look like a Barbie. That is so cute, isn't it? Please tell me I'm not the only one thinking that. Okay, but now on the other side of my face, I will try to shade Deep Freeze. I'm not sure if I'm going to use this highlight and blush, maybe. Let's just use it as highlight at first. And this was, I think this was the most pigmented of all of them. I'm kind of scared of this. <laughs> oh. You know what, let's try to use it as highlight and blush, kind of. Like, it might just be me being me. <laughs> but I kind of like it. <laughs> Okay, but yeah, uh, overall, I really, really like them. I will totally do this for sure. This one, I will make work. Make it work. <laughs> I promise you, don't you worry, I will make it work somehow. I think it looks cool, even though it looks kind of weird. But yeah, like first impression of them though is that they are huge, so this will last me a lifetime. I really like them and I think it's cool that Jeffree has brought out these colorful highlighters. I think that they are kind of powdery though, but I think that is what makes them so pigmented. So it's not really a bad thing, but just so you guys know. So you guys, that is it for this video. If you would like to see a full-on lip swatch video on every shade that I have, from Yefri Star Cosmetics, the liquid lipsticks. Please give me a like and I will do that for you. And also if you have any favorites on uh, any of the lipsticks that I show today or any of the highlighters and you want to see more of them in a makeup look, comment down below and I will make that happen. <laughs> so yeah, other than that, please give me a like and if you haven't already, please subscribe to my channel. Um, and yeah, I hope you have a great day and I hope we'll see each other in my next video. Bye!